Hello friends, how are you? Dima here. Uh, so I've been having an issue with my Predator uh, 3500, the second one I bought. I'm in Arizona here, it's hot as fuck. And my generator is doing the same thing that the first one was doing. The carbon monoxide detector light goes on and it shuts down. So I figured out a way. I went found some videos on the different model how to bypass the carbon monoxide detector and it's actually super easy I figured it out instead of two wires there is three wires in there so I did that and I also removed the uh, bypass the charcoal filter you can find the video there is a video on the YouTube I'll post the link below uh, to that video how to how to bypass it it's super easy as well so um, I'm gonna post some pictures in here and show you exactly what needs to be done um, so the generator been running now for 20 minutes without any issues look how nice and smooth it is no problem doesn't shut down it's freaking beautiful I love it okay so the generator is nice it's just that that thing is faulty and many people complain about it but somehow nobody posted the actual video on that generator so uh, you just need to uh, remove the plug and uh, connect red and gray wires together uh, the wires that go to the engine so you need to remove the front panel uh, so I'll show you quickly what the screws are and what needs to be removed because I already did it and I'll show you the pictures uh, how it looked opened up six of these there is also a screw right here i don't know if you can see it i hope you can in the in the thing so then you can take it out and then these screws you actually don't need to remove these you just need to remove this panel and the wires are all inside just this one i opened up the whole thing but it wasn't necessary so just this panel needs to be removed this screw needs to be removed and that's it super easy all right, I'll, I'll post the pictures and you can see exactly what I what I did. Ciao. Basically, connect uh, the um, you can see the plug. Uh, connect the red and um, gray and leave the yellow in there. Just uh, tape everything together so the yellow doesn't short on anything. And that's it. That's the plug that goes to the engine.